As a single woman, every time you post your picture online, you're unknowingly increasing the number of people who are lusting after you. I'm not sure how you find pleasure in it. Maybe you call it blushing, when random men comment on your beauty or your skin. But here's the truth. Many of them are simply hoping for a chance to be with you temporarily, not to commit to a lifetime with someone constantly on display for the world to see. The bigger dilemma is, because your pictures and videos keep attracting men to your DMs, it's going to be difficult to find the right suitor. Everyone says, I love you, but how will you know who truly means it? There's only one right man for you. How will you identify him in the midst of so many? I'm not even a fan of DM proposals, but in today's world of social media promiscuity, it seems to be the norm. This is how many end up with the wrong person. And later down the line, when the mistakes have been made, you might be asking someone to hide your identity as you realize you married the wrong person. Hundreds of men may use the same words, I love you, but with completely different intentions. Some may be genuine, others may just want a fleeting moment with you. Some might simply want to associate with your image, and some might even have harmful intentions. Now, consider the modest women, those who are largely unseen and unknown on social media. Their DMs remain quiet because a heart doesn't long for what the eyes have never seen. A woman who is demure, reserved, modest, and avoids public scrutiny finds it easier to choose the right spouse. She doesn't have to sift through a sea of DMs filled with empty words. Only a few men of true piety approach her, and even then, it's rare. She doesn't spend her days on display, and her image doesn't fly around on social media, so no one knows what beauty lies beneath her niqab or jilbab. These women are shielded from the attention of unworthy men, leaving them with only a few genuinely good men to choose from. And with istikara and istishara, the right choice becomes clear. She finds the one who is deserving to see her true beauty, the man who will be her partner in this life and the next. Yes, even the most virtuous woman may still be tested with a difficult marriage, but it won't be the same as ending up with someone completely unsuitable, someone from the streets. The more hidden you are, the better your chances of attracting a pious spouse. The more exposed you are, the higher your risk of falling into the wrong hands. Unless, of course, you're not seeking a pious man to begin with. May Allah guide and protect our women. Amin.